In the realm of the unexplained, SCP-030 emerges as a captivating enigma. Picture a hairless, gray-toned humanoid standing a mere 28 inches tall, with eyes as blue and cold as cut sapphires. This entity, known as Ariel, converses with an androgynous voice, laced with an unplaceable English accent, and possesses knowledge of multiple languages, some unknown, and a breadth of academic understanding that transcends the historical record. When exposed to light, Ariel is active, engaging with its surroundings. However, plunge it into darkness, and it becomes as lifeless as a stone, only to awaken when light returns, as if roused from a peaceful slumber. Despite its clay-like composition, Ariel is more than an animated statue. It doesn't breathe, eat or produce waste, yet it has a desire for cleanliness, occasionally requesting a bath. It can be damaged but feels no pain, reshaping its deformed anatomy with ease. But take heed, it cannot be molded by human hands. So who created Ariel? Whenever asked, it responds with a rehearsed statement, I have been asked to forget that bit of information, terribly sorry. Its origins remain shrouded in mystery, yet hints suggest a link to the alchemists of Alagata. In the world of SCPs, Ariel continues to perplex and fascinate, a testament to the endless possibilities of the unknown.